stationary drag series builds a player's ability to drag or manipulate the basketball. The more a player is able to manipulate the basketball, the more they can do with their feet and their body, and the more dangerous they are off the dribble. Carter is going to perform 10 phases each, front same, front counter motion, side same, and side counter motion. In front same, Carter is going to drag both basketballs in the same motion out front. He wants to create a V dribble with each basketball, dragging it inside to outside his knee. After 10 reps of the basketballs moving in the same direction, Carter is going to switch right into front counter motion. The next phase, Carter's going to narrow his stance a little bit and he's going to go into side same. Carter's now going to drag those basketballs as far as he can on the sides of his feet. After 10 reps, the last phase Carter's going to jump into here is side counter motion. He's going to push and pull those basketballs in an alternating motion on the sides of his feet. The better players get at manipulating the basketball, the more they'll be able to create space with crossovers and other dribble moves.